What up? That I don't know that what that was. That I was talking about Naruto with my uh, fellow cohorts here. So I try to do like some hand signals to activate my chakra. Uh, anyways, let's uh, begin the eBay break, shall we? We're gonna go ahead and do 2018 Allen Ginter baseball four box break number eleven. I always wanted to do like I love I love anime. That's I'm a nerd, right? And people always ask me, if you could have any superpower, what would you have? You know, and people, you know, at least here in the States, you know, they hit you with the comic book stuff. Not me. I I would like to, you know, turn Super Saiyan or something. That would be cool. I don't know if that's a superpower. Or instant transmission. That would be great. Nice, Matt. Is there anything you're uh, looking for in particular? Maybe you're looking for those Megalodon relics. They got some crazy stuff in this set. What up, Big Greg? Not Little Greg. Big Greg. What up? You got it, Ray. Have a safe flight if I don't uh, talk to you. I don't know, man. I feel like that internet, that, that you know, the flight internet, I feel like that's just a scam. I feel like everything's a scam, really. Well, Big Greg, I didn't do anything, dude. You, you just won it, so. Nothing to do with me, good sir. That's all you. So thank you for uh, buying into the store. Because then lovely things like that could happen, you know? You make one purchase in the store, and you could win some break credit. You know, that's that's the beautiful thing about uh, what we do. Sorry, eBay. But uh, if you want to get into those giveaways, like our daily, weekly, and our monthly giveaway, you got to check out the site first. RipCityCards.com. Baby! I actually... Let me put this up real quick, like. God, I'm glad they took that off. That was so annoying. And at the end, let's top it off with that. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, man. I got to redo it then. All right. This is to put the uh, name of the break on the screen. Make make everybody's life a, just a little bit easier. All right. So in the first hat, well, the first third of this to be technical, uh, we hit a box topper autograph, which I had never seen before. It was a uh, Paul Goldschmidt box topper auto on on card, if you will, for the uh, for the old Arizona Diamondbacks. It was very nice, very nice. Uh, well, Smokey, today you know I, I decided to do things a little bit differently with the daily giveaway. Uh, I usually do the daily giveaways at the end of the night. So as to not take away from the show. But uh, today I, ex I extended the time. It's usually from 12 a.m. to 6 p.m. You know, if you make a purchase within that time frame, you're eligible for our daily giveaway of $100 on our website. But uh, I did send an email out earlier today stating that if you bought into, noir, you know, into any of the basketball breaks, whether it's Noir Basketball or Crown Royale basketball, for each team you bought, you would get 10 spots for the uh, daily giveaway. Because I want to get rid of all that basketball stuff, all right? I just want to be over and done with it. Let's get it out the store. Let's give away some moolah. And, and yeah, let's go ahead and do that. So again, I extended the giveaway until 11 p.m. today. So as long as you buy into a basketball break, 
each team or each spot you buy gets you 10 in the daily giveaway. So uh, go ahead and get on that, my basketball fans. Well, Smokey Jenkins, we also have other baseball stuff in the store, too. Uh, we actually got some more Immaculate Baseball. We got that in the store again. Uh, a little Bowman Draft from 2015. A little bat, uh, Blast from the Past. Got that in there. Chronicles Baseball still in the store. So I, I got baseball. What's up, Kayla? How are you? All right, well, Smokey, the next thing I need, I, need, I need you to do now, I need you to tell all your friends about the uh, the old Cardboard Moses and Cardboard Jesus over at RipCityCards.com. And then have them tell their friends and so on and so forth, all right? That way we could be, you know, be ripping all day and night long. Diamond Icons does look good. It does look good, Jimbo. Uh, I got two cases of it. One of them is going to go to to a certain special somebody. While the other is uh, going to go in the store. It's going to be a, a 10 spotter. More than likely, hit random style on that Diamond Icons. That stuff is not cheap, let me tell you. It's going to it's going to be like $150 for a for a spot in a one box hit random of diamond icons. There's seven autographs, two relics and a base card or a parallel, what have you. In a box of diamond icons. All right, whatever. So I'm debating about whether or not to put like maybe do like a PYT of it and do it box by box that way. I, I don't know. A, a lot of ideas in the old noggin. Uh, what is a pyramid bonus? I, I don't know what that is, Smokey. Did you really, Jimbo? Nice. Oh, Big Greg, I haven't done that break, actually. I have not done that. Been lazy. Didn't do that. But I will today, actually. I'll do that after the uh, these four eBay breaks that I got going on. I'll go ahead and knock that out. And then we'll get on to the store business. What day is it? The 29th? What does that mean exactly? Okay, we still got two days for the rest of the month. Yeah, yeah, Greg, you didn't miss it. Do you have to work today? Or, or what? I mean, Smokey, why, why you gotta be like that, though? Why, why, why I gotta be like that? Why, why can't you just do it out of the kindness of, of, your, of your heart? Because, because you love what we do and what we do for you. You know, why, why, why has it got to be like that, man? See how it is, Smokey Jenkins. See how it is. Oh, okay, so you're still on vacay. You know, I thought today was Thursday. I thought uh, the football, the Dolphins were going to play today. But it's tomorrow. Word Smokey. That's what I'm talking about. The credit will come in the form of good, amazing karma and even better hits. So, so saith the cardboard gods. And, you know, they don't call me Cardboard Moses for nothing. I, I know things. 
I, I see, I hear, and I know things. Well, Smokey, listen, I, funny enough, maybe it's not whatever, but like when, when my friends found out what I do for a living, basically, they pretty much laughed at me. But when I see them, uh, you know, cry and moan and complain about their, their 9 to 5s and, you know, and their bosses and their co-workers, I'm just, I, I laugh at them like, ha, who's laughing now? I like what I do. You know what, though, Smokey? Some of those pops can go for big money, dude. What up, Flyers fan over on Breakers? That Some of those pops can go for big money, dude. Uh, a friend of mine actually collects pops, and he gets them signed by like, depending on the cartoon or the pop or whatever, he gets it signed by like the actor or the actress or the voice actor or whatever. So he's like really into it, and he he probably has like a little a little gold mine. He's probably sitting on a, a little nice little trust fund there. He don't, he don't even know. Yeah, Matt, dude, some of that stuff goes for money, dude. Did you sell it after he uh, he became the mayor of uh, of whatever town? They they sold a Bob Ross pop. Damn, I would I, I need I kind of need that. The the buddy I'm telling you about, he's actually he's gifted me three pops. And, you know, he, he knows how to get because I am a nerd. Nice one, Matt. Nice. Hashtag, do your research. Dude, I bet stuff like that happens on the daily. Hold up, Jimbo, hold up. You don't know who Bob Ross is? Are you kidding me? You don't know who the legendary Bob Ross is? That That is... I feel highly disrespected right now. Alright, Smokey, I'll, I'll admit, I have no idea what that is. Remind me not to sleep over at your house? Because horror figures? Yeah. I ain't going to sleep. This man does not know who Bob Ross is. Wow. You know, Jimbo, sometimes I forget that you, like, live on the other side of the world. I forget that you're technically on an island. It's a massive island, but, I mean, technically it's an island, right, by definition? I know it's a continent, but technically it's an island? Well, technically we're all on islands, actually. See, I forgot the name of this movie. I just I can't believe that you don't know who Bob Ross is. Okay. Well, you know what? I'm I probably should not be so that surprised. So Bob Ross 
is this dude who is a national treasure and he is a painter. Yeah, yeah, he, he paints like landscapes. He paints, basically he paints landscapes from Scrizatch. And uh, yeah, he does happy trees, very happy trees. Uh, and it, dude, it's it's all it all started with a show. Uh, I forget the name of a painting with Bob Ross or something like Bob Ross paint something like that. It used to be on PBS. And when I used to skip school, you know, and I'd be home alone until like six o'clock or whatever. I you know I would like scroll through the channels, mind you. I didn't have too many channels to pick from growing up. So you know I would kind of gravitate through towards the. Uh, some obscure channels like PBS, you know, uh, the Public uh, Broadcasting System, I believe, is what it stands for. And you know, after they were done showing Arthur and the Reading Rainbow and blah blah blah, they would eventually show like Bob Ross. And Bob Ross used to paint these happy trees, and he is a legendary painter, and has probably top five greatest afros of all time. A legend in every sense of the word. The man is a national treasure. Books have been written about him. You know, hymns have been written about him. He he is a uh, he 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 is he, he yes Bob Ross Bob Ross. Or you could just look it up on YouTube, man. You can find anything on YouTube. Just YouTube Bob Ross and uh, and enjoy. All right, so Gohara of the Braves mini. Always check the back of those minis. Because some are hand-numbered. Mr. Wagner, Pirates. Got a, uh, a framed mini relic here for Mr. Benintendi. Red Sox. Oh, for sure, Cameron. For sh for sure. E like and like, dude, that afro transcends even that. Top five afro of all time. Not up for discussion. Uh, the Pepper X uh, mini. Mr. Otani. Angels mini. Arachnophobia mini. Oh, come on. Uh, the mismatched socks. The uh, superstition mini. That's a. I wish I could grow my beard like that. Mr. Bradley. D-Bags mini. Hank Aaron. Braves mini. Phillies uh, Williams Mini. The promo card for Souza of the Rays. Bias Cubs Mini. Well, the thing with I think the the glossy boxes I think are two per case, I believe. My uh, memory escapes me, but I believe it's two per case. Verlander Astros maybe. I just I want to see something really cool, man. Like maybe we'll get the rip card in, in this uh, third. Hamels Rangers. Piscotti of the A's maybe. Hicks Yankees mini. JD Martinez with a relic for the Red Sox. Peterson mini Mr. Wagner Pirates mini Kenley Jansen of the Dodgers so we got three relics at that box each box has three hits Mr. Jones Giants mini 
Zobrist of the Cubs. Mini. Kingry, Phillies rookie with the mini. A mini here for Dexter Fowler, Cardinals. Another Otani, rookie for the Angels mini. Johnny Bench, Reds mini. Got the uh, postage required mini. Mr. Bellinger, Dodgers mini. Oh, dude, Scotty. It would probably have to be... It was a Mike Trout, Shohei Otani rip card. I think it was numbered to like 15 or something like that. That's probably the sickest card I've seen. I Just, just based on what could potentially be inside that card. I mean, the rip card alone is pretty sick. A Mike Trout, Otani dual rip card, that's pretty sick. But what's inside of it? I, I don't think the guy ever ripped it. But I can only imagine something ridiculous is in there. Thames Brewers Mini. McCann Astros Mini. But like, aside from a rip card, I can't think of anything too crazy, honestly. Pepper X Mini. Yeah, Aaron Rodgers, isn't he like the highest paid player in the NFL now? He signed like a 30, 100, 100 something plus million dollar extension. Duval of the Reds, Mini. And Teddy Bridgewater got, yep, traded to the Saints. I was hoping he would have got traded to the Dolphins, man. We, we need desperate help at quarterback. He a Watha, Mini there, the uh, indigenous heroes. You know, I don't know why the why Dolphin fans or, or just the Dolphins brass are sold on Tannehill. That guy sucks. Ryan Braun, Brewers Mini. We just we've become accustomed to mediocrity in Miami. This is very true, Ray. That's the thing about those uh, rip cards is you never know until you rip it. Rodon, White Sox Mini. The Phasmophobia Mini. Beckham. Orioles Mini. Trey Mancini. Of the Orioles with the Relic. What about y'all? What's the sickest hit you guys have gotten out of uh, the old Allen and Ginter? Rubley's Nationals Mini. Oh, pff, Drew Brees ain't going nowhere. But, you know, Teddy Bridgewater maybe for the future. Crawford Phillies, uh, mini. Ooh, there you go. That's nice. A little uh, Cardinals mojo. Paul. Well, is it is it Paul? I think, I think that is his name. Paul DeJong. The Cardinals uh, framed mini. Decent. Uh, Urena. Blue Jays Mini. Mr. Piazza. Mets Mini. Shawoba. Cubs Mini. Clevinger Indians Mini. Well, Big Greg, believe it or not, it's sometimes it's not all about that. Sometimes people actually collect these things. Could, could you believe it or not? Mr. Kovacs, Dodgers Mini. Yeah, and it's way more fun to rip the card. I mean... So we do what we do. Kipnis Indians mini.
Oh, Ray, I know, I know who you're talking about. Yeah, I've hit, I've actually hit uh, his autograph before, which I thought was kind of cool. Cause I want to be on an Allen and Ginter card, Lindor Indians mini. So I don't know, I don't know who I gotta talk to, uh, to, or who I gotta get in contact with to make that happen. But uh, a cardboard Moses rip card would be pretty awesome. A Goldschmidt home run derby promo card there. Eric Osbert. Padres uh, mini. I I know, Big Greg. I'm just busting your balls, man. There you go, Ray. Nice one. Kenley Jansen Dodgers mini. How long is that flight anyway? Tyler uh, Glass now. Pirates mini. I want to see like a a freaking dinosaur relic or something. Manningly Yankees mini or like a Method Man autograph. Mr. Shoop of the Orioles with a relic. A uh, Flag of Lost Nations mini. Great Chuck of the Blue Jays mini. Always got to check the back of those minis because, you know, some of them are hand numbered. Three hour flight, uh? Not too bad, not too bad. I uh, I, I just might uh, keep you entertained for all three hours. Uh, Mr. Clemente. Pirates Mini. Gritchuk Blue Jays Mini. The Abraham Lincoln Mini. Ronito Door. Rangers promo, Neshek of the Phillies mini, the Mangus Coloradas mini, that means colored sleeves, or at least that's what it translates to, That it, it, uh, that's Spanish, or at least it's, uh, those are Spanish words, for sure, which translates to colored sleeves, that's kind of random. Uh, Mr. Henderson, Yankees mini. What's going on in Kansas City? Hopefully a party or something good, Ray. Mr. Thames Brewers mini. Mr. Odor Rangers relic. Mr. Jones, Orioles, Mini, Betances, Yankees, Mini, the uh, Ophidiophobia, Mini, the Fear of Snakes or something. Mr. Story of the uh, Rockies Mini. The uh, Flags of Lost Nations Mini. Mr. Boar. Marlins Mini. Manny Machado. Orioles Mini. Matsui, Yankees Mini. Miss Stevens Mini. Mr. Jones. Braves Mini. Mr. Zimmer. Oh! Shooter McGavin! With the auto! I've been waiting on this! That is awesome. I know that's not his name, Christopher McDonald, the actor. But dang it, that's Shooter McGavin. 
That's awesome. That is awesome. I, I got I got to put that on the uh, on the old social media. Mr. PR, Blue Jays Media. I hope you know who Shooter McGavin is, Aussie Jim. I hope you know who that is. Don't know who Bob Ross is. What's wrong with this guy? You know, every day I lose a little faith in humanity. All right. Well, what do we got? Cozart, Angels Mini. There you go, Jimbo. Joey Votto of the Reds with a little relic on there for you. I wish he, I wish he signed it, Shooter McGavin. I hope the 101 is him signing it as Shooter McGavin. Uh, Pepper Eggs, Minnie. Garcia, Brewers Mini. The uh, Sitting Bull Indigenous Hero Mini. Mr. Puig. Dodgers uh, Mini. That movie's so good. I love, I love, um... Grandma in that in that movie. What the heck? Never seen this. A bucket. <laughs> the pregame meal mini. Never seen this mini before, actually. That is freaking awesome. The uh, the old baseball superstitions. Somebody ate like a, a ten piece of chicken, fried chicken or something. That's nuts. Mr. Gonzalez, Rockies Mini. Got another auto here. First, we got the Archer Rays Mini. The autograph is for the rookie Dominic Smith of the Mets. Very nice, very nice. Matter of fact, we got a few autographs. Got three of them so far to be exact. Wonder if we're gonna hit that rip card. Benjamin Franklin mini. Mr. Uh, James mini. Austin Hayes mini. Excuse me. The seven pot uh, Dougala. The world's uh, hottest peppers mini there. Anybody watch Hot Ones on uh, on YouTube? That the dude that does the Hot Ones uh, show of about like eating spicy chicken wings with like celebrities or whatever. He actually has autographs in the stuff. McCutcheon. Uh, Giants mini. What's his name? Uh, Chris Evans, I think is his name. Sean Evans. Rendon National Mini. Mr. Stroman. Blue Jays Mini. A mini for uh, Mr. Dawson of the Cubs. I see like a frame there. I see I see something there lurking for us. Mr. Gallo of the uh, Rangers, the Home Run Derby promo. Mancini Orioles Mini. Chapman Yankees Mini. Got that cryptocurrency. Donaldson Blue Jays Mini. Followed by the Donaldson uh, Relic. For the uh, for the old Jays of Blue, Mr. 
Mr. Winka. Reds a mini sauce. Maria, tall chief, mini. Right, let's see what this is about. It's a Manny Machado relic for the Orioles. Uh, the frame. You got Orioles with a little something, something. I don't. I think that was the three hits for the box. Maybe a rip card. I don't know. Lost of flags. Uh, flags of Lost Nations. Uh, mini there. Anthony Rizzo, Cubs mini. That's a fire hazard, Jimbo. I don't know how they do things in Australia, but we don't do that around here. Mr. Gibson, Cardinals mini. Although that would be kind of cool. You know, similar to the rib card, you know, you could strike this uh, this match and possibly burn your whole card. Beltre, you know, and, and the surroundings. But Beltre Rangers, I don't know. How would that work, Jimbo? How, how would you do that? Are you just into chaos? Or, or, or is there a genius behind that idea? Stevenson Nationals, maybe? This guy wants to see an embedded matchstick on a card. So that way, you're literally pulling uh, fire. <laughs> Kiermaier, raise me. Flaherty, Cardinals. Maybe. I'm sure there's a way to do it. Make the card out of like titanium or ceramic or something. That'd be kind of cool. I don't know. And then when you like light the match. It like burns so that you could see like the person's autograph like on the I don't know that'd be I don't know. It's 2018. Let's do some cool stuff now. Nowadays, Guriel Astros mini, and that's gonna do it for that. All right, well, let us see what's in these uh, box toppers. We got this one, the uh, N43 they call it. See what this is about. A Lindor Indians mini, or whatever you call this, the M43. I'm sure you do, Scotty. I'm sure you do. Let's uh, see what happens though. We have a Cal Ripken Jr. box topper for the Orioles. It's a Babe Ruth. No way he could have signed that. Unless they uh, cranked up the old time machine. And then, you know, went up to 70 miles per hour. With your 1.7 gigawatts or whatever it is. And we got an Altuve mini. Or I should say box topper, my bad. So no autos in the box toppers. Although I did see one last night. In the uh, first third of this, which was the first time I ever seen a box top auto, but none today, unfortunately. No rip card either, which means the third half of this case. Uh, I do believe the box, uh, the rip cards are two per case. So two of those four boxes that we'll be ripping Saturday will have uh, two rip cards in it. Hopefully, very interesting. All right, let's see what we got uh, here for this recap, though. We got a Machado, Orioles uh, frame mini, a Donaldson Blue Jays relic, a Votto Reds relic, an Odor Rangers relic, Shoop of the Orioles relic, Mancini of the Orioles relic, Jansen Dodgers relic, Martinez Red Sox relic, and a Benintendi framed mini relic for the Red Sox. Autographs we have... Mr. DeJong, Cardinals. A uh, Smith, rookie for the Mets, autograph. And 
quite possibly the uh, greatest card I've ever hit. Shooter McGavin! Not Christopher McDonald. No, not that guy. This is Shooter McGavin. And I will hear nothing else of it. And that was a break. Freaking Shooter McGavin, yo. Thank you very much. We'll get that out to you.